Oh, you spend half your life looking for something, and then when you went looking for it, you find it. Have you ever found that? No, because I'm still looking for it. <laughs> As the song goes, I still haven't found what I'm looking for. It's funny, when you come of age, you, you reach your 50s, right? Which I've only just started, obviously. Um, and you tend to start forgetting stuff. So you, you're there doing something, and you think, right, oh, just get that. And by the time you've gone to get that, you forgot what you're getting. So you have to go back where you started again and look at what you were doing to remind you what you were going to go and get. <sighs> Snackering, isn't it? Anyway, a while back, I was looking to fit a windscreen and I, I have a piece of rope here, right? This is probably, this means nothing to anyone, but maybe someone can relate to it. And there's a piece of rope here, which is especially designed for putting windscreens in. Okay, and uh, I love this bit of rope because it makes life so easy, you know. And it's just a bit of rope. It means nothing to no one. But there you are. Anyway, I couldn't find it. I looked high, looked low, pulled my hair out. I even went on eBay to see if I could find some more. And uh, I couldn't. So I gave up and thought, one day it'll turn up. Well, I was right. Today's the day. There it was. I goes in there, moves a box, looking for something else. And there's the rope. Anyway, after all that, welcome to episode five of the ice cream van. New engine fit, jobby, whatever you want to call it. <coughs> Excuse me. Right, today we are going to be taking the front panel back off so we can fit a new bottom hose easily. I mean, it's six bolts. It's easier than struggling trying to get down in there. So we're going to fit a new bottom hose, um, put the panel back on, put it all on properly. We're going to fill it with water. We're going to see, let it run for a bit, let it warm up, make sure there's no leaks. After that, we'll drain it out and replace it with coolant, the whole system. Okay, so that's what we're doing. After that, we're going to fit the front panel on with new piping around the wings and new nuts and bolts all the way around. And then we're going to put new headlamps in as well because the old ones were pretty, pretty knackered actually. Um, I'll show you what they're like. If you want to look in there, they're uh, rusty. You see the rust on the reflector in there? So past it. So because the van's going to get used quite a lot, we're going to replace them with a more modern halogen type. It still looks the same. It's just a flat rather than bulbous dish. So um, that's what it's going to have. Hmm, happy days. So after that, we'll fit the front bumper. And after that, it should be pretty much good to go back, apart from a good clean, because it's got a little bit greasy on the front end there, so we'll wipe it over and tidy it all up. And uh, it can go back and back to work. And we can get on with the next thing, which is going to be that, or that, or that, or that, or that. Actually, there's only two here, but there's other things in here. Anyway, so there you are, that's what we're going to be doing. Benny's here. Do you want to come around, Benny? You're always hiding behind the camera. He's looking suave today. He's got his best shirt on. You see that? Oh, talking of shirts, we've had a couple of requests, uh, well, more than one, two, maybe three, uh, for some T-shirts with our logo on, a bit of merch, like, you know, so and some caps. So we're, we're looking to get some of that, well, we are getting some of that done um, pretty soon. So we'll let you know, well, you'll know, because we're wearing the hats, probably, and the shirts, once we're working, but, um, yeah. What do you reckon? Mm -hmm. And uh, if, if any of you would be interested in anything like that, let us know what you'd rather have. You could have a shirt like this with some stuff on it mm -hmm. and something else on the back. Like, like Benny says, that's lovely. You could have that on the back or uh, happy days, which is what I always say, or something like that. So just drop us a note on, on the bottom and let us know if, if that's something that interests you. And get some idea on how many to get, because the last time I want to do is order like five T-shirts and end up with four. Mm. which is probably what's going to happen, isn't it? Mm. Anyway, very early days for the merchandise, as you can tell. But anyway, um, just let us know that. So we're going to crack on and uh, get this little thing done. Crack on and get this done. All right, happy days. Let's go. I'm going to put my rope back before it goes missing again.
So here we are, broken hearted, paid a penny and only. Anyway, we've got the bolts in. You see them? Yep. Uh, so we've managed to get them all in there. God, blimey, I tell you. Found some new old sock rubbers for the top, which is really weird. Still got the plastic on it. It's barely peeling off. But anyway, uh, I'm just going to whip these up, tighten them up. I had to put an extra couple of washers on for some reason. <laughs> Never can tell. Don't forget, if you think back, this was welded on and a bit out of shape. It's had a bit of a prang in this corner, this van. So, um, oh, anyway, I'm going to whip these up if we can. And once we whip these up, we'll connect the hoses, Benny. Bottom hose is your job because you love laying down. Yeah. All they want to do, teenagers, is sleep. Isn't it, Benj? Right, moving on to the front panel. We'll just turn it over, put it on a table so we can put the new captive nuts in instead of uh, using nuts and bolts like we're in it. And uh, notice that um, whoever done the spray job on this um, didn't care too much and uh, just filled all the perforations with filler. You can see it oozed right through the front panel um, all, all over it. Basically, there's a big dent in the front panel here. You can see that the way that it's pushed in and it's just filled so you can't see it on the outside, but there it is. Anyway, so it's gonna have to come back at some point and uh, have a, a new front panel uh, fitted uh, or a good set, well, a good second hand one, a new one is just completely impossible to find just about, apart from I happen to have one, I think, but I'm saving that. Um, so th this is either gonna have to have extensive work to repair it or a really good second hand one. Anyway, moving on. So, next job is to fit all these uh, captive nuts. Uh, some of the areas are a bit damaged, but we'll just have to cope with that. They just go in from behind like that and clip in. I'm a bit slow. Hang on. There we are. Hang on. He's a bit slow. Well, I would never say that about you, Benny. No. But since you brought the subject up, oh, I'll go with it. No, seriously, I'm just putting it back on the tripod. I wasn't in the right place. Say that again? I was putting it on the tripod and I wasn't in the right place. Okay, that was my shoulder. Yeah. Anyway, so we've got to fit all these. Yes. And then we're good to go on that. And then I've got over here, I'll bring it over. Hang on, save it, turn in the camera. Uh, this is obviously um, teaching you uh, to um, suck eggs if you know all this, which you probably do. But basically, then this will go through the front of the wing, a bolt with a decent washer on it, and then you can just screw them straight in there. And God, then it make life easy. So they're playing about, you know? So it makes life easy and obviously makes a better job of it. Well, pretty much. So a bit of wing piping around here, a bit of new stuff because the other stuff is all uh, perished and, 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 yeah, perished. And also painted, which is kind of odd. Yeah, so it, you know, like I said, it's it's had a quick job, isn't it, in the past? So we get all these fitted, and uh, I need a little screwdriver for some of these to push them in. Where was that little screwdriver, Ben? Did you leave it? Oh no, I put it back actually. I'm oh. surprised. God, I tell you what, you should warn me before you frighten me like that. I'm very, very sorry. Right, so we're going to put these in. Behind. Sorry? Thingy stand there. Anyway. Anywho. 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 That's this hole is completely out of shape, so I'm having a bit of a nightmare, but it's in. It's in. Morning. Are we back on air? Oh, indeed. Where's the red light? Huh? Oh, we haven't got one of them uh, yet. Oh, okay. Yeah. On air. Mad Works Garage, on air. Mm. Anyway. Uh, oh, that was my finger. Yeah. That's alright, I've got another one. Did it hurt? No, it didn't. Oh, it just okay. missed. Oh. It just scratched the surface oh, of my skin. Uh, ow. You see it? It hurt when I, like, poke it. It does a bit. Mm. Why are you doing that? No, I don't know. It's just amusement, really. Mm. Mm. You like to inflict pain on your father. Well, you like to inflict pain on me, so it works both ways. When did I inflict pain on you? Well, you know when you squirted that WD-40 on me, it burns the back of my neck. Don't be ridiculous. I actually did. I 100%. I got, I, it's, it's been itchy ever since. Um, can you hurry up? I've only got one more to do. Right, okay. Anyway, you should have done some of these. Oh, well, you took all the 
glory of doing it, so I didn't need to. Well, do you want me to take them out? You can put them in again? No. Okay. What's the point now? Just double handling everything. Exactly. Just stop making such a big fuss about it. I think we've got about another thousand front panels here. Huh? <laughs> we've got about another thousand front panels here to put on at some point. <laughs> right, that's that. Let's get this here. Where's my cutters? There they are. Now, if you if you ever do a bit of rubberizing, any of you? Yeah, putting rubbers in, window rubbers, uh, wing piping, uh, any of that malarkey. Invest in, if you do quite a lot of it, invest in a pair of them. These. Uh, can you see those? Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Invest in a pair of those, right? It'll give you all the 45 degree angles, all the, well, it gives you all the angles 45, 60, 75, 90, 105, 120 angles. Angle of and you can cut things nice and straight with it as well. Angle of it's just great. You don't have no Stanley knife worries. It does take a Stanley blade. It just takes the Stanley blade. This is brilliant. Just brilliant. Right, I'm just going to measure this on the wing. Well, we'll clean it when it's fitted. Oh, I did say that. Professional, we are. We are so professional. We are. There's nothing quite like us. Oh, I'll drop my fingers. Right, so it doesn't have to be too neat because you ain't going to see it, but get that in there like that. The only bit you see is the bit that's sticking out. And then when you do the bolt up, that will clamp that in place like that. Yeah, we we'll cut the others as we put them on because you can get them exactly right then. Yeah? Right, so there's one for that. Uh, there's one for there, over there. Like that. And now we need to get the front panel into position. Are we doing that now? No, we're going to do it next week, Benj. You don't need to move that. No, I need to move it back. I'll move it, you can move that. That's it, move that. Right, we're going to put this, pop this on the front here, temp to, 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 over here. That'll do. Right, now, just hold it there, just hold it there, got it? Now what we do, because it's got two holes in the top there, so if you put a couple of little nuts and bolts through there, or just bolts through, it will just retain it from slipping too much. Right, okay, so it's just sitting there. Already it looks like a van again, yeah. doesn't it? Already, bless its little heart. Anyway, um, so next job is we need nuts and bolts well, sorry, nut, uh, bolts and washers, should I say? Not nuts and bolts. Where's the penny washers I had yesterday? Uh, it's still in the tray in the back. Alright, I'm going to go and get some penny washers. Right, can you actually bring the camera over and go in there with it? Right, inside there you can see the little bolt coming through into the captive nut. Uh, so I'm going to put the next one through there and into the panel. Yeah, but you see how easy it is compared to messing about with nuts and bolts. This is the the way you sh it oh, can't get it in. The way it sh should be. Done. <laughs> hey? Huh? Oh, that's it. You make yourself a coffee. I'll go. I'll go without. <laughs> that had a bit of a burr on that. That's why it wasn't going in. Right. Let's try again. So we get that in there like that. There you go. Actually, that one's tight as well. What's going on there? What's going on there? Have you been mixing up mine bolts? Are you sure? Oh, that one's fine. So it's fine. It's obviously me not doing the job properly. Right, so that in there like that. Oh, that's gone now. Okay, so it just pinches. Okay, we've got two little slots in there. One goes in here, one goes in there. You just wiggle that in. And we'll take it round the corner. Now, when you get to the corner, you've got to cut. You've got to cut uh, triangular bits like this. Uh, it's a bit of a boring job. But to get it to go around the corner, this is the, the way to do it. Have I got it in shot? Have I got it in shot? Yeah. Right. This isn't the best wing piper in the world, but it, it's fine once you get it in there. It's just a bit stiff. I could soak it in hot water, but I haven't got any, so I won't. 
Hey ho. Hey ho, there we go. Anyway, back to it. So we're nearly at the end of this one. Fine, fine adjustments. Yeah. Like, you put triangles in, or you just... I already did. Where were you? What? Where were you when I told them about yeah, that? Yeah, it was a fit around the corner. But do you also know? Do you ever know why that it, you use triangles? You know, you well, it, it, I already like did. Octagon or something. He does. He, he, were you asleep? Now we need to get this in. So Benji will have to assist me with the assistance. 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 Yeah. So you need to get that. You're standing right in the way of the camera. I know it's awkward, but they ain't going to be able to see what you're doing. Let's get it off there for a minute. Right. Well, I'll pinch up the first one. That'll pull the panel in, right? Yeah, okay. So, we'll get this up behind there. Yesterday. Is it on? I can't tell. No, it's not on the bottom. What's the normal bolt then? Yeah, that'd be a good idea to hold that in there. Yeah, no, the idea is if you get this first bit yeah. just on the lip, yeah, yeah. right? Yeah. Bring it so it's level with the edge of the wing. Okay. Yeah. Is it going? Yeah. And we're not turning. Alright, does it pinch it up? No, not really. Let me have a look. Mind your chodes. Oh, it has pinched it up, so I can't move it. Right, so for the second one, that needs to be held down. You can pull it from underneath. Grab the rubber and pull it down. Why aren't it pulling down? It is. Well, pull it right down. Right, hold it there. It's a bit awkward, I know, but I've got to get on the second bolt. Where is it? Right, okay. Okay. Right. Oh, that'll be the phone again. Oh, Lord. I'm going to pause the video. Hello, my father. Right, so we're feeding this in. Um, it, it's pretty much in the right place, to be honest. So I'm going to waz this side up and pull that up. Where's the next bolt? There. It might need some adjustment, but until we get both sides on, we, we, we can't really tell. I mean, you've got to remember that um, none of this has been new. This, none of this is new. This is all old. And what did it fit like before? I know we took it off, but did you check and see what it fit like before? No, nor did I. It's had a front end prang in the other side at some point. And now we've straightened that out with a new cross member. So maybe it's slightly out of shape than where it was before or in shape, but all the panels are out. Whatever happens, it looks better than that pink paint on the rubber. Put that to yourself. That's better, it's gone in now. Right. Okay. Yeah. Check it in. Well, that. That's, see, the idea is is to get it in as you go. But it looks pretty good, doesn't it? You haven't done the bottoms yet. No. Okay. Well, I'll start at the top then. Mhm. Mm you get that. We got the camera on. Camera's on yet. Yeah. Yep. Um, did you want the mic back? No, you're right. Right, I don't want to like lean on it. Alright, I'll have it. 
Yeah. Thank you very much. Still on? Yeah. We still on? Testing, testing. Right, put that in there. Okay, let's get the side buttoned up then, mate. Out. Don't worry about it, it's the one halfway down. I know it is. Right, get the top one buttoned up first. We go through the headlamp. Save laying on the floor. No? Go on. You've got to wind it right in. Okay, it's fine. Hang on a minute before you go mad. Get this in there a bit. Right, next one. Right. Next one. Hang on, there one up here. No? Alright. Go on in. Right. Need to cut this bottom one. Just use a pair of scissors scenes there. Yeah? Don't know where the other things are. I've got some little tiny stubby ones with yellow handles. Yeah. They're the best ones for this, if you can find them. In well, that's what is the easiest thing with this. Okay? Yeah, ready? Yeah. Right? Yeah. Just split across that wing there. What split? That. Yeah. Filler. Go on in. Huh. Right, ready? Yep. <laughs> right, that's it. There you are. <laughs> Very good indeed. Let's just put that in the inside. I'm getting it all caught up and everything. Um, lovely. So there's two bolts and washers to go in the top there, Bench. Those temporary ones. You can do. See these ones here? Yeah, so put a penny washer on the top, drop them through. Nut and bolt, yeah? Do them up. Sorry? Nut and bolt. Yeah. Uh, little spanners here somewhere. A little 10 mil. Like yeah, and then a bolt on the bottom. Uh, and you want a washer on the bottom and a nut, yeah? Not a bolt, a nut. No. Alright. They're there, aren't they? No. Okay, bring them out. You need some more, so you might as well bring them all. Uh, now we're getting there. Indicator. Okay, so that comes through there, goes into there. I might have to buy a lot of these for my car because I think the plastic clips are just, they just break so easily. Just check that indicator works. Yeah, you're right there. No. Now? No, back one. Is the back one working? Yeah, back one works. The back one's working now, is it? Yeah, yeah, back one. Why is this not working then? <laughs> okay. Oh, it's interesting. It might be a bulb. It's plugged in, so we'll check the bulb in a minute. Right, I'm just going to spin round on the headlamps. On the headlamps. Oh, yeah. Nice bit of camera work, John. Lovely. Uh, right. 
should give us a bit of a view. Um, got a pair of pliers anywhere, Benji? Out here? Benny, even? Just zoom out a bit. That's better. Now then. Alright, so we've got to strip these out. Put them in here. Because this has got the more modern wiring. So we can fit these halogen lights. Okay. Which are brand new. So, new bowls, very good bowls compared to the old ones, and uh, so we'll have them out of there. Some pliers needed, and I'm going to have to undo all this. Yeah, always the way, always the way. Have you got any small screwdrivers out? Yeah, there's one over there, isn't there? Is that too big for that one? Yeah. Oh, that screwdriver's good, isn't it? You turn it and it doesn't turn the actual... Oh, Lord. <laughs> Ta da! We're finished. Happy days. There it is, all back in one piece again after its engine transplant. Uh, it's now sporting its new little eyeballs, headlamps, which are halogens, 
which will improve it no end anyway if it gets caught in the winter night out and about. But it doesn't look too out of place, do they? A bit flatter, a bit flatter. But nice and new, which is the main thing, and no rust in the reflectors. But it's not been a bad little job, really. It's all gone quite well. The only thing we can't do is fix this, because I don't have any sort of glue that holds it down. So new number plate's in order, but it's not a big job. Uh, so you can order a couple of plates for it. It looks smashing. Ben's giving it a bit of clean-up. All the electrics are working now and everything as it should do. Engine's as good as gold. All the gears are there. We're finished. Yeah, indeed. Hmm. Done. Inside's clean. Yep. Uh, seat's clean. Yep. Bumper's back on. Yep. And clean. And clean. Not rusty anymore. Uh, hockey sticks are on. The cat whiskers. Cat whiskers. Sticks. Hockey sticks are on that one. Hockey sticks. Yeah. <laughs> too many. <laughs> too many hockey sticks. Well, I don't know. Gears work. Yeah. 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 Job done. Job done. Yeah. Oh, rubbers in. Rubbers in. Lights. Lights. We, we're going round and round in circles, yeah? On. Yeah. yeah. Coolant's done. Coolant, yeah. Coolant. Coolant. Yeah, it's in there. Ticks over, runs. Yeah. 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 So, happy days. We'll see how it goes then, and that's come back for six months' service. Indeed. Well, they can do it themselves. Yeah, it's not hard, is it? No, not with a new engine, eh? No, no. Zero miles. Zero miles. Yeah. Which we'll just demonstrate the lights, shall I? Indeed. The lights yeah. working? Yeah. You yeah. might not see them on the hyperlapse, too Might not. Here's uh, the side lights. And then we've got the main lights. So nice and bright. Yeah. And we've got indicator left. Indicator, yeah. And the indicator right. And there you go. Sorry? That one's in a bit of electric as well. Oh yeah, don't like doing them, but there you go. It, it all works. So there you are. That's the end of the, uh, the job. And uh, happy to have done it. And, and uh, another one back on the road and doing its stuff, really. And selling ice cream and, and drinks and all those lovely things that we love to eat, which makes us fat. Hmm. But never mind. You can eat and eat and eat. Christmas coming. We can eat a lot then. Yes, Christmas. And then spend the whole of January and February trying to lose the weight you put on at Christmas. Mm. But we don't mind, do we? That's no. Mm. We'll probably be out here Christmas. Indeed. Yeah. Christmas Eve. It takes me back, you know, to that time when we done that van, that other van. Blue. Van. The blue van. And uh, it had to be done. Uh, well, it didn't have to be done. It had to be done for January, didn't it? Mm. And then he phoned me up and said, I want it back today. On New Christmas Eve? For a Christmas present the next morning. Oh, I don't think it was for that, was it? Yeah. Was it? Yeah. You I can't remember that bit. Yeah, you picked up Christmas Day, didn't you? How old were you then, Benny? Four or five. No, how old were you really? Four or five. About three, four or five, I don't know. Yeah, you're about four or five, I think. Four, five, six. Yeah. yeah. It's a long time ago. Oh. That's the compressor. That's the compressor. Just turn that off. Oh, this is. Anyway. Yeah, phones me up, want it back today, uh, sorry, Christmas Eve latest, so, and this was the day before Christmas Eve, it's like, oh my God, not even road tested, nothing. Getting it, couldn't find third gear, third gear was missing completely, so what did we have to do? What were we doing? What was we doing, Benj, at eight, nine o'clock on Christmas Eve night, changing a gearbox, he was only five. Six, about six, seven, yeah. Oh, he's, go he's going up, he's seven. He was right, seven. It's about five, six or seven, I can't remember. I could actually tell you exactly when it was, but yeah, I'd have to look it up. To look it up yeah. But you were very young. I was. Yeah. yeah. And he helped me put a gearbox in, and bless his heart, he did it. We've got pictures somewhere, haven't we? We do, yeah. yeah. Anyway, we're blabbering on. Anyway, there you go. Job done. Thanks for watching again. Madworks Garage, me and Benny. Mm -hmm. You know, doing our stuff, doing what we do. Doing our thing. Yeah. And uh, I hope you enjoyed this little uh, five episode series on, on this little old van. And uh, there'll be another one, uh, another video coming up real soon. Um, it'll probably be on the Smiths, will it? Yeah. Possibly. Um, and various we, other little projects that come yeah. in there. Yeah. So we'll, we won't leave it long and we'll be back again, um, won't we? Yeah. Well, anyway. This one's edited and whatever. There'll be mm. another one on in, in the, what, what do they call it, in the works? In the pipeline. In the pipeline. In the line of pipeness. In, in one's line of 
Mm. So don't forget, guys, let us know uh, below if you're interested in merchandise, hats and T-shirts, just to give us an idea of how many to order, if we're going to order any at all. Right. Also, if you fancy sponsoring me and the, me and the wife, uh, um, our 300,000 steps that we're doing for the children uh, this month, um, you can find on my uh, Facebook page um, a, uh, a thing, a, a Just Giving page. So if you see that, and uh, even if it's a quid, 50 pence, absolutely anything else, um, we can get some new incubators then. Um, we, we, our target was £100, which obviously we've gone by, thankfully, to everyone. Um, but I think we only buy about 20 quid. Mm -hmm. But, um, you know, it's still £120 more towards an incubator or whatever it may be, to, uh, to help the, the little children. Yeah. Mm. So if you fancy doing that, please feel free, and uh, we'll be much obliged to you. Um, and, yeah, and uh, any other comments, please leave them. Uh, any questions? Any questions? Yeah. Any, any videos you might want us to do uh, on, on anything specific, on, on the Bedfords or whatever, yeah, just let us know. More interesting than these? Yeah, it's hard to beat. It's pretty much hard to beat. Anyway, that's it. So it's goodbye from him. And it's goodbye from me. Goodbye, yes. And we'll see you in the next one. Sad, isn't it, when we say goodbye? It is, yeah. Mm. yeah. Anyway, right. we're going. Okay, till next yeah. time then. Yeah. Take care, everyone. Tally-ho. Oh, like and subscribe if you haven't. Bye-bye.